The Nigerian Army Social Media Seminar has been described as a veritable tool to effectively educate the Nigerian youth and social media handlers on the responsible use of social media to collectively enhance national security, unity, harmony and economic development in the country. The General Officer Commanding GOC 8th Division of the Nigerian Army, who doubles as the Commander of Special Joint Task Force Northwest Operation Hadirin Daji, Major General Godwin Muktuk Mutkut, told the participants that the dissemination of dangerous and divisive messages is detrimental to social harmony. I charge you all to actively engage in the discussion in this seminar to gain deeper understanding of how reckless sharing of damaging messages, videos, and voice notes on social media could jeopardize our peaceful coexistence. I also urge you to take copious notes, seek clarification where needed, and it will give us a better understanding of this seminar. The Chief of Civil Military Affairs, Nigerian Army Headquarters, Abuja, Major General Nosakare Ugbo, urged social media handlers to understand that each post, each share, and each comment on social media has the potential to undermine or strengthen the collective efforts towards a peaceful and united Nigeria, hence the need to use social media responsibly and ensure that digital footprints leave indelible marks of peace and love for mankind. While we stand united, we must realize that each post, each share, each comment, on the social media has the potential to either undermine or strengthen our collective efforts towards a peaceful and united Nigeria. Governor Dauda Lawal of Zamfara State, who was present or represented by the Commissioner for Youth and Sports Development, Musa Shinkafi, stressed the need for social media handlers to always verify their contents before posting or sharing to avoid escalating conflicts or damaging an individual's reputation. Always check the credibility of the source before sharing any information. Really unreadable news, reputable news, outlined an official statement. B. Test checking. Use fact-checking website and tools to verify the accuracy of the information you encounter online. C. Critical thinking. 